greatness of a person is in his ability to deal with provoking situations. Every human being has a hot button that one conceals from the world. And every now and then you will find somebody coming and pressing that button. And there are some people who come into our life that don't just press the button, they hammer the button. <laughs> and you just don't know how to deal with these people. When we go through a health test, we mentally are prepared for a prick. But if you're walking on a street and suddenly a thorn pokes you, what happens? You scream. I mean, it's, it's just too much trauma, right? But the size of the pin is exactly the same. But why do you react differently? The reason is because in the first case, you're mentally prepared for it. And in the second case, you're not mentally prepared for it. And therefore, when you're not mentally prepared, you tend to be very, very reactive. When you're prepared, you tend to be very, very calm about it. This is exactly what life is. Uh, there are two ways to deal with provocations, deal with life in general. One is the soda bottle way and one is the whiskey bottle way. The soda bottle, if you look at a spirited uh, you know, can, you shake it and you open it. What happens? Everything comes out. You know? And the and a whiskey bottle, you shake it and you open, nothing comes out. There are two ways to live life. One is known as a reactive way of living life and the second is known as a responsive way of living life. When you live a life based on reactive ways, that means the moment you are shaken up, life shakes you up, somebody shakes you up, and then there are some people, no matter how much they are shaken up, nothing happens to them. This whole ability to be responsive and not reactive is all about actually learning to talk to yourself. In life, we need to learn to talk to ourselves. Responding is about talking to yourself first. Reacting is about speaking and then thinking. Responding is about thinking and then speaking. In life, many relationships can be saved. We just understand this one principle of responding and not reacting.